Greetings and thank you for this opportunity to come to you today. Spend a few moments in God's Word and pray with you. We trust that these brief insights that we are bringing will lift up your spirits and build faith in you. If you've experienced abuse or trauma, that you will be able to look to God to receive healing for those problems. In Genesis chapter 41, verses 51 to 52, Joseph, uh, the Bible says this about Joseph. It says, Joseph called the name of his firstborn Manasseh, for God has made me forget all my toil and all my father's house. And the name of the second he called Ephraim, for God has caused me to be fruitful in the land of my affliction. Now, if you, if you look at the story of Joseph, his life, we recognize that he went through traumatic experiences. He was abused by his brothers. They laughed at him. They demeaned and devalued him. They laughed and mocked his dreams. They sold him as a slave off into Egypt. And there he was further wrongly accused and put in prison. And these experiences surely must have been traumatic for Joseph and in a strange land. And yet God had worked something in Joseph's life and God had brought Joseph to a place where he could make these two powerful statements. And commemorating that, he named his children after those things, those, those, what God had done in his life. First, he said, God has made me forget. Second, he said, God has caused me to be fruitful. You see, when we go through abuse or trauma, there are triggers that could bring back those memories, painful memories. And sometimes we wonder, will I ever be able to forget the pain of my abuse or the hurt that I've gone through and the trauma I've been through? Will I ever be able to come out of those negative, hurtful, painful emotions and feelings and memories. I want to encourage you from what we read here about Joseph. The same God who worked in Joseph's life can work in your life and mine. He can cause us to forget our pain, our affliction, our suffering, our abuse and our trauma. And He can cause us to be fruitful in the very place, in the very environment in the world or the same city, the same town where you, you were once struggling and caused you to be fruitful. Yes, it hurts, but there's a God in heaven who can change that. There's nothing wrong in going to God and saying, God, cause me to forget, cause me to be fruitful. He will do it. Let's pray. Lord, we acknowledge that there are times when triggers cause us to remember the pain, the hurt, but we look to you, the God who can cause us to forget and make us fruitful. So let there be healing, Lord, for those who may have experienced abuse or trauma in their lives. Cause them to forget, heal their memories, and cause them to be fruitful. In Jesus' name, amen. Thank you for tuning in to Living Supernaturally. For more resources to strengthen your spiritual walk, please visit apcwo.org.